In our previous video, we learned about the acute complications of diabetes, if you haven't seen it, be sure to watch it, it is necessary to better understand the video you are about to see. The main chronic complications of diabetes are, retinopathy, neuropathy, nephropathy, cardiovascular disease, and diabetic foot. In this video you will learn why they occur, and what their symptoms are. Every time our heart beats, our organs receive oxygen and nutrients through the blood that flows through our arteries. Thanks to the oxygen and nutrients they receive, our organs can stay healthy. But in the human body everything is a question of balance. High concentrations of glucose, damage and deform small and large blood vessels. Furthermore, tissues are also damaged directly. By deforming these blood vessels, they become defective and begin to cause complications in our body, such as high blood pressure, ineffective wound repair, and a reduction in oxygen and nutrients reaching our organs, causing the complications that we mentioned at the beginning of the video. Diabetic retinopathy is a chronic complication that decreases visual acuity and can cause blindness. The retina is the inner membrane of our eyes, and is responsible for eyesight. It receives rays of light that travel to the brain to allow us to see. With diabetic retinopathy, the blood vessels that reach the retina are damaged. The retina loses its ability to properly perceive light rays, and the patient starts to see black dots in his visual field, blurred vision, a decrease in the vividness of colors, and functional loss of vision. However, the patient may also initially present no symptoms. This is why patients with type 1 diabetes, should visit the ophthalmologist 5 years after being diagnosed, and patients with type 2 diabetes, should visit the ophthalmologist as soon as possible when diagnosed. After their first evaluation, they should return every year. In diabetic nephropathy, the kidneys begin to pass protein into the urine, a condition known as proteinuria. With the progression of this condition, kidney disease can occur, which can lead to kidney failure and possibly dialysis. The symptoms of diabetic nephropathy are weight loss, swelling of the ankles or feet, swelling in the eye region, itchy skin, cramps, tiredness, and a high frequency of going to the bathroom to urinate. But it can also present without symptoms. With the objective of checking the health of your kidneys, your doctor may require periodic checks to measure the concentration of creatinine in your blood, and protein in your urine. There are four different types of diabetic neuropathy. Depending on the type of neuropathy, the symptoms may be, difficulty perceiving changes in temperature, tingling sensations, pain or burning in the extremities and ulcers or infections in the feet. For this reason, it is very important to avoid walking barefoot if you have diabetes, and look at your feet every day to make sure you don't have injuries. Changes in bowel habits, diarrhea or constipation, may also occur, or losing the ability to perceive the symptoms of hypoglycemia, palpitations, sweating, trembling, dizziness, altered mental status, among others. A poorly controlled diabetes causes cholesterol to build up in the arteries and can obstruct the flow of blood to the tissues, which in turn, artery obstructions mainly in the heart and brain. Patients with poorly controlled diabetes, have almost twice the risk of heart attack or stroke than a person without diabetes. To avoid these complications it is very important to maintain adequate control of blood glucose, and follow the recommendations of your care team. Producing this video, required working together with doctors, scriptwriters, graphic designers, animators, and our narration editor. We have a huge library of videos. Subscribe to our channel, and activate the notification bell to see them first. If you like the way we explain, and you want to sponsor one of our videos, please visit our website, or contact us at the email that appears on the screen. If you would like to support us, please become our Patreon. 
you will find a link in the description. Thanks for watching. See you in our next video.